MineLab changes people's fortunes by inventing and manufacturing the best metal detectors in the world. And metal detectors are used to detect precious metals, coins, uh, artifacts from historical um, battles. Then we also have a third division that manufactures metal detectors for un recovering unexploded mines in the humanitarian space to recover the land for like farming, building houses, and actually replacing people onto the land um, to function moving forward as a regular society. So a lot of the war-torn parts of the planet um, have used a mine lab mine detector to recover and remove unexploded mines to recover their land. And one of our biggest clients and one of our biggest um, uh, customers and users of the, of the mine recovery uh, detectors is the U.S. State Department. It's actually a lot of physics involved uh, with how the minerals, based on what ground type um, you're detecting in, how they react to the frequencies uh, shooting into the ground. So what MineLab has done over the last 30 years is, is patented, patented over 25 different technologies um, to really shoot into the ground and, and recover uh, with accuracy the kind of metal that you're looking for. Our relationship to the Codan Group is that we're a wholly owned subsidiary of Codan, which is based in Australia, a publicly traded company in Australia. And the Codan Group uh, manufactures uh, really high-tech uh, radio devices. So a metal detector really is a radio device um, and a radio frequency that, that shoots uh, frequencies into the ground and receives them back. The Codan Group also has high-frequency radios that basically can work in the environment without a cell phone tower. And again, for the same purposes of really helping people in um, underdeveloped and third world type countries to communicate with, with each other um, in times of disaster, times of war, those types of things.